Age gap relationships are becoming much more common, but the question is always for younger guys, how should they show up? How do you impress an older woman who's more sophisticated, more worldly, and maybe you're even comparing yourself to some of the people that she's had in the past, a past husband or an ex that was famous or successful, and you're wondering, how can I bring something to the table? This is Susan Winter for SusanWinter.net. Welcome. Welcome subscribers who've come back. And as you may know, I wrote one of the seminal books years ago called Older Women, Younger Men. And that was an international bestseller. So this is a topic that I know a little something about. How should a young man impress an older woman? Firstly, step one, please be yourself. If you're putting on airs, we'll know it. You don't have to. If she's accepted a date with you, if she's talking to you, if she's chatting you up, she likes you. Don't try too hard. Two, don't pretend you're someone you're not. I know you think you have to, but it's actually the fact that she's not even looking for that. Here's what you don't understand about an older woman. She could have what she's had. She left it or she lost interest in it for a good reason. Why do you think she's looking at you? No, it's not just the sex. You have fresh eyes. You have a new perspective. You're fun. You're lighter. You're not carrying the enormous baggage of the man that she left. And you really are something unique to her. She is looking at something that's different new input, a different attitude, progressive thinking, evolved consciousness. This is what she's looking for. So if you try to be what she left, that you are wrongly assuming she values more than you, then you've missed the whole point of this. What's going to ignite her interest is the fact that you are a free thinker, that you're independent, that you have a personality, that you have your opinions. It is not for you to be impressing her and trying to gain her attention with being something you're not. This goes straight across the board for anybody dating anyone of any age. It is simply to show up as ourselves and be the best version of ourselves, to be engaged and to be thoughtful and to be listening and to play off of whatever they say. Pick up the cues. What is she talking about? Is what she's talking about interesting to you? If she's brought up a subject and you don't know anything about it, ask her to tell you about it. Then tell her about something that you know about that maybe she doesn't know about because a lot of the times you don't know number three, we're actually learning from you. An older woman who wants to expand her life is learning what you have to share. This is part of the fun. We already know what we know. We don't know what you know. We're here to learn from you. So please don't let yourself fall into the trap of, oh my God, she's the oracle. Just because she's older, she knows everything. No, she doesn't. She knows what she knows. You have a whole new life perspective and that's yours to give to her. So be yourself. Please try not to imagine that you need to be something that she left. Be uniquely yourself. Show up, be attentive, listen, interact, and try to relax with this whole experience. I know you'll be, oftentimes young guys are judging themselves. And another thing that they do is you want to lie about your age. Okay, I do have to talk about this because I was going to do a whole video that's separate on this, but I expect that people are going to lie online. I expect that women are going to lie. I expect that men are going to lie about their age if they're younger and they want to be with an older woman. I expect if a guy says 5'10", the truth is he's 5'7 and a half. I expect that. And we all should. But if what you're saying is too incongruous to where you are in life, it could trip you up. I understand if you think you must fudge by a couple years because she wouldn't even pay attention to you. You'll have to deal with that later. I don't suggest it, but I understand human nature. I understand that people are scared. I understand that they have to say what they have to say to get them in the gate. Again, not advised, but I understand it. But if you try to posture that you have a job that you don't actually have, that maybe you're studying in school, that you have some kind of incredible home that you own, but you're living with four other guys. These lies are, again, going back to what I said before, you're trying to be something you're not. 
that will never work for any of us of any age. Who you are is unique and it is special, so trust that. Susan Winter for SusanWinter.net. And if you're interested in reading about older women, younger men, there is an entire category on my website that says articles. And underneath it is a click through that says older women, younger men, and it has dozens and dozens and dozens and dozens of articles on each different topic, if that is an area of your interest. And you can also see my uh, different consultation packages under consultation. Thanks a lot. Susan Winter for SusanWinter.net.